and I'm going to go down in history as the greatest inventor since Thomas Edison. I'll show you! Edgar's invention. Uh, out of all of them, I thought it was very uh, simple and very clean. It got like the moral of the story, and uh, it ended off very well because, you know, it had a clear opening, and, you know, as you go out, you're wondering, what is he going to do? And then at the end, when he, like, he, instead of actually really inventing something mm -hmm. that he wanted, he found out something better. So I think overall that was like a very good story to be told. It, it had like overall moral theme to it. So mm -hmm. I like that. It, it, was, uh, it was very sweet with its um, sort of Frankenstein doctor esque sort of humor to it, and then that lovable twist at the end. Um, I just thought this one was so satisfying because throughout the whole thing I was like, but why? But why is he doing this? But why? And then that moment when he fa finally realized why, it was just so, as like someone watching the film, it was like, oh yes, you gave me exactly what I wanted and more because this is not what I imagined at all. So I just, yeah, I was really happy with the ending of it. It had this lovely, um, you're right, it had this lovely little candy ending. You're like, oh my god, water balloons. That's that's delight. That's childhood in a in a twenty-five cent package. And then you have this wonderful moment where he, he makes his mark on the world. Right? Our hero's journey is complete. What did you guys think of the of the design? It shifts tone dramatically. Yes. First of all, I love the art direction in this film. Everything looks so good. They they must have spent a lot of money on it or just because it, it, it looks like there's a million dollars on screen. I love the fact that, yes, a lot of inventions are accidental, of course, right? Penicillin was an accidental invention. Uh, vulcanized rubber was an accidental invention. Popcorn? He's, okay. I didn't know that was an accidental invention. And I just hope that, I hope he leaves that horrible wife behind and takes his millions and goes find somebody better. <laughs> Late again? I'm sorry, Mary. I had to get some work done. You said you'd be finished by six. Well, they needed that character, too, to be like, you're going to be a failure. You're a fool. <laughs> to, like, really hit home his drive to show them all, right? Like, it was necessary, even if it was, like, big and been funny and, right? I love the art director, too. There's a lava lamp in his lab, and there's that thing that has a lightning that you touch it and the lightning. Like, there's little little Easter eggs of funny in, in it throughout. Yes, you can watch this movie, like, eating chocolate. It's... The yeah, so I like the ambience of the film, especially like uh, when it was like really special, suspenseful at the beginning. And then it's like you started to realize like, oh, there's actually a lot of humors inside. And you love the fact that the guy just kept persevering, even though it's like his wife was telling him, was like, no, you can't do this, and blah, 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 and all those things. And then it's like he pretty much turned a negative thing that like what like he wanted to do uh, was like uh, it didn't turn out the way he wanted to. But then it's like he found out like, oh, I can actually make something that uh, like I didn't think was gonna be able to to work into something else that's gonna be able to work for it, you know. So I love the ending for it. They say it's loosely based on a true story. One of the things I like is that well, the production looks high quality, yet it's done so simply. That transaction of two hands in the quarter, and then like passing this like one thing of water balloons back and forth. With that little montage probably only took them maybe an hour to do together, but it was so clear that what was happening, right? Like they did something so efficient and so economical at the same time. So props to them. Uh, just one last thing, I think that the, direct, the director was doing a really fantastic job for the film.